Hey everybody, it's Camo Dave here. It is uh, Tuesday morning, the uh, 30th of March, 2021. We've been, uh, we, would, we did a live stream last night and uh, we got a lot of uh, input from you guys in the Camo Dave army there about uh, Dave 2D. Apparently Dave 2D, he's a, a guy that I've been watching for many years on uh, YouTube. Um, you know, there are two Dave 2Ds. There's a technical Dave 2D, there's a computer e channel and stuff like that. And then there's Dave 2D, the, the, the nomad, or at least the, elect, the former nomad. Anyway, that's, that's the one we're talking about here. That, uh, the Dave 2D, that is the nomad that currently has a house up in the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. He's from California. He's been traveling around for many years. Uh, he had at, I think he had an, he currently has an element. He had a van. He's had different vehicles over the years. He has a dog, uh, now and, uh, I believe her name is Zoe, right? I'm not, you know, again, I get all the dogs mixed up. Anyway, this is, uh, the news we heard last night was that Dave 2D has pretty much pulled everything, pulled all of his videos off of uh, YouTube. Now, that, they can, that can mean just taken private, but there, none of his videos are available. They're gone, um, <clears throat> and uh, he's also jumped off of pretty much all of his social media platforms, everything from, from Twitch uh, Instagram, etc. Uh, something terrible happened is what we're hearing. Dave 2D went dark on social media after the woman he had just roasted in his most recent video, Lee McMillan, uh, she is part of the v Van Lifers Max and Lee channel, uh, committed suicide. Now, Dave does what, you know, what he had been doing in addition to some of his traveling, was these roast videos where he would talk about mainly very young, beautiful nomads and their life on the road, and he'd have, you know, fun with it, parody them, make jokes about them, stuff like that. And and Lee, and Max and Lee was one of the channels that he was frequently covering. Anyway, um, so we're hearing that Lee uh, has committed suicide. Um, he just roasted um, that um, she... she how he hand, how she handled the breakup with Max. So Max and Lee broke up. Okay, uh, she apparently she jumped in front of a train in Santa Barbara last Friday afternoon. Man, man, oh man, she had been reported as a missing person, but it was too late, according to our source here in the uh, the news. Um, one of our news sources here. Uh, it was in the newspapers, as was her death. There are tributes to her all over Instagram. Her Instagram account is Life with Lee. I think it's safe to assume that um, uh, Dave's uh, Dave 2D left social media as a result of this. And we have another source that um, says that you know Dave had stopped doing the roasts for a while. You know, it was uh, with the move to the house up in uh, the Upper Peninsula, Michigan, where he's been spending the winter, mainly doing paintings and stuff, and drawings and paintings and stuff. He's been doing a lot of live streams with that. Uh, but, uh, he decided, I guess, to start doing the roasts again and had reposted some of his o older roasts there on his YouTube channel. So another source says he started going back to the roasts to stop losing subscribers on YouTube. He was dropping subscribers because, first of all, he wasn't doing much traveling anymore. And second of all, he wasn't doing the roasts anymore. And the roasts got him a lot of views. I mean, he was getting hundreds of thousands of views on some of those roasts. Uh, so yeah, he started to turn things around and was starting to get viewers again and, um, and subscribers again. One of our sources says, I think after this, after this incident with the uh, Lee suicide, that he will never do a roast again. The comments will be just filled up with people mentioning this particular incident. Anyway, this is from KEYT in Santa Barbara, and that is, uh, Lee. Man. The Santa Barbara Sheriff's County Sheriff's Office identified the woman hit and killed by a train last week near Santa Barbara. Lee Ann McMillan, 28, from Santa Barbara. Uh, Friday afternoon, uh, this was, what, the, the C, 29th, 28th, or something, 26th, something like that, the 26th. Emergency crews responded to a train overpass on Hollister, intersection, or Hollister Avenue near the intersection of Hollister and Modoc Road. According to the Santa Barbara County Fire uh, Captain, uh, a pedestrian was found dead at the scene after being struck by the train. Uh, Santa Barbara, on the next day, Santa, Par Santa Barbara police were asking um, the public to help find McMillan. She, so, so they were looking for her after they found the woman's body after that, it had been hit by the train. Anyway, uh, she had left her Santa Barbara home earlier and was reported missing her car, wallet, keys, ID, and cell phone were found left at the home. 
Police feared that McMillan, a Canadian citizen who was living near Santa Barbara for about six months, may be suicidal. Man. Anyway. Wow. Anyway, this is Max and Lee's channel. And I guess after the split up, they created separate channels or released separate sections here. And uh, 496,000 subscribers. And uh, yeah. Max and Lee from the beginning. They travel through South America, building a tiny home, Australia, <clears throat> van life confessions, van tours, and then uh, then they did us. They then they split up into two separate channels: Max and his dog, and Life with Lee. And this was her channel, and uh, yeah. So uh, we won't run that video there, but uh, anyway, then, anyway. So her last video was about uh, two or. Two or three months ago. Oh, a month ago. Okay, let's check here on her last video. That was uh, one month ago. Female van build uh, catching up. Anyway, so a really, really, really sad, tragic story here. Uh, and, uh, you know, I, you know I, I do, you know, I do a critical channel here. We try to have fun with some of these no nomads. It really nothing is we try we do is in mean spirit. Although some people think a lot of the comp some of the comments that we do on the channel tend to cross the line of sarcasm into mean spiritness. We try to keep an eye on where things go in terms of the comments, but you know at least I try to do a you know we keep it to a certain level of entertainment and having fun with some of these channels and try to build the channels up and get them some more viewers. And I'm sure what Dave D was doing was probably getting more viewers for um, Max and Lee. But apparently um, things took a really nasty turn. And uh, so anyway, really sad, really sad story here. We'll be interesting to see how Dave uh, handles this in the future. If he comes back to YouTube, puts some videos back up. If he was is planning to do any more, um, any more, roast videos because they were very popular but uh you know very sad very very sad story here we'll keep you updated as to what we hear more about max and lee and and, and lee's passing away and uh dave 2d's reaction to all this all right folks thanks for watching vlog under